Hi, and welcome back to my channel. I am Diamond76 Home Decor on a Budget. And for today's video, this is what I have been waiting to come in. Okay, one of the things. And if you're looking, if you're looking at it, it looks like a love seat sofa, but it is not a love seat sofa. It is a satay. And um I just love and I looked at we looked at so many of them that we winded up going online uh, because I wanted something different. I wanted something, uh, I just wanted something that was more me, that fit my style. And this was it right here. And what I did was when I saw the, uh, let me say this, before you order any furniture, always measure your space, okay? And when I, I looked at the measurements of how long and how wide this was, um, it is, I think, about 51 inches long, I think, 51, 52. So when I measured from with the, with the inches where it was 52, um, I knew that I had more than enough space for this to fit in. As, 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 I don't know why I'm stuttering. As... as as well as the width of this, okay? And I wanted to make sure that it fit comfortably in here, that it was not overpacked and that it was not overcrowded. Now, right now, it is overcrowded because I got everything on the floor. Now, I did have before, if you've seen my videos before, I did have two chairs here. As a matter of fact, this right here is shorter uh, as far as the the length go than the two chairs I had right here. The two chairs I had right here took up more room, okay? And another thing is too, the reason why I wanted something like this here is this is where I sit a lot of the times to watch my YouTube videos. And when I watched my YouTube videos, I was curled up in my chair. And let me tell you, when you spend 20 minutes or more curled up in a chair, and look, I am 54 years old. Let me tell you something. I could not get my legs. I had to push my legs out those chairs uh, because... I had been balled up and curled up in the chair because I wanted to be comfortable when it comes to watching my YouTube videos. Now, one note, warning, my phone is at a crazy angle. So if my phone falls, okay, I'm, I'm just letting you know. And the reason why I have it the way that I have it is so that way you can see me because I'm going to decorate this really quickly for you. And I wanted you to see exactly what I was talking about. Now, with this sate right here, it comes with wooden slats, okay? And I'm going to see how they work. Now, they did come with my platform bed. Now, everyone knows that when you have a platform bed, they do come with slats. What I did was I wanted to ensure that my bed was not going to crash, okay? Okay because I have my bed so high up and that's the reason why I'm able to have my camera at the angle that is it. If you was to see how I'm holding it up, you would laugh. But yeah, this came with wooden slats. Now, like I said, I don't, the reason why I switched out the slats on my bed, um, I went to Home Depot and I had to go get this just so you can see what I'm talking about. Now, it wasn't there wasn't this, the boards wasn't, was not this short, but I cut it uh, because I wanted to use it for a project when I do do my spray painting. And see, look, <laughs> do not laugh at me, okay? But this is what I use. You can tell I had something sitting right here when I spray paint. So, okay, but I, but I needed to show you an example because I didn't feel like going to the garage. So, this is the wood that I decided to get from... Uh, Home Depot, okay, and I measured my bed, okay, to make sure that I had enough uh, more strength than the slats, okay, so that is the reason why I did not use the slats on my bed, but I'm going to see how these work, okay, but I'm, let, I'm giving you an option, okay, if your slats do break, okay, because I did read some horror stories, if they do break, Okay, know that there is an option for you. Okay, now if you want to, um, I've seen some people use metal, uh, 
uh, I can't think of the name of it, but they go across, okay? Like, like the slats are. Um, I can't think of the name of it. I just cannot. But if you feel like these are not strong enough, because when you press on them, they, you see how it's moving? Like I said, I don't know if it's going to hold. Um, sometimes I've heard that the, the, the black things that I had, I wish I had to show you this before I put it together, but I was tired and I wanted to get it together. But these black things, sometimes the, the wooden board does uh, move out of them. And let me see if I can show you on this picture. Uh, okay, see right here, let me see. Right here, these are the slats right here that you're supposed to stick the or put uh push the board into right here on each end right here and right here and sometimes the board may move back or shift back and it'll cause it to come out of the black slats uh the black holdings or, or i don't know what you call them so like i said there's always an option especially if you have a platform bed like i said if you want to you can get these wooden boards right here, or you can put two on top of each other and just measure, okay? I would have to take this off, which is easy, and then if anything happens, and I can go get some more boards. Okay, now let's get into the video. Enough of that. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate this, and I'm going to show you how I'm going to decorate this, and... Let's go ahead and get started, okay? So, you may not see me, my face, but you might see my legs, but that's okay. Okay. Now, these are the cushions that came with um, with the satay, and this is the back right here. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place it in here, okay? And I'm going to take this one, and I'm going to place it in here. Okay, and wait a minute. Let me get them in there. Okay. Okay. So this is how it looks with the cushions in here. Okay. And to be honest with you, yeah, <laughs> it is kind of hard. It, it, it is, but not uncomfortable. So, what I'm going to do is, and if you see me keep pulling up my pants, that's because my pants keep falling down and I don't have on a belt. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this throw right here, and I did post this on Instagram, and it had been folded up. So, I got to give it some time for the wrinkles and the creases to fall out. And I got this from Macy's Backstage, and it is this long, if you can see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold it, and for the sake of this video, I'm going to try to, because I don't want it to be too long, I'm going to take it, and I'm going to toss it across the sofa like that, and I'm going to push it right there, and I can bring it down a little bit more. Okay, now if you want to, if you use something like this, you can push the sofa up against the wall, but if you don't want to you don't have to it'll just keep this from falling because every time you sit down it's going to fall or either i'm gonna fix it another kind of way but for right now for the video okay so what i did was i went to uh the at home store and i picked up two of these pillows right here and this is the color they are a gray with a hint of blue but on camera it looks like it's coming off silver and these are these are by studio style and they were 19.99 okay and i have i'm not going to take the price tag off right now because i just want to show you how i'm going to decorate this and what i do is to make my pillows fluffier is to hit them up against my knee I'm going to take it, I'm going to karate chop it and put it right there. Here is the second one, and I'm going to hit it up against my knee to fluff it back out, okay? And I'm going to stick that right there and karate chop it, okay? 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot something really quickly. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Um, this is a pillow that I've had for a while. And I got this from Macy's Backstage. And it's HMC Hallmark Collections. And this was $42, but that is not what I paid for it. It was on sale. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick it right there and stick this right here let me push it to the back okay i'm gonna push that to the back turn it that way okay and then what i'm going to do is i also got these from the at home store and these are by home boutique and they were $14.99. Okay, and these on camera look like they have sort of like a, a purplish undertone in these. But these are, yeah, they, they are gray. They are gray. And let me go ahead and put these right here. Okay. And using this color right here will offset the gray of the settee that I have right here, okay? As well as the canvas art that I have on the wall. So that is the reason why I wanted to bring in some kind of other tone or some other type of uh, tone to go with the gray that I have back here. So that's what I did with that pillow right there. And right here is the second one. And like I said, I'm going to bluff it, but I don't want my video to be too long. Now you see how it was really wrinkled back here? That is simply because of how they had them packed in or probably in the box when they received this. So those wrinkles will eventually come out. But what I'm gonna do is when I picked it up, I did see the wrinkles in the front. So when I turned it around to the back, I don't see that. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it right here. And you may think that may be too many pillows on the sofa, but I like pillows, I, I really do. But like I said, see how I have the different, uh, the different tones and the different textures. Like I said, the gray, the lighter gray is in the back. The uh, gray right here, and it looks kind of purple, right here in the front. And I have this one right here with the design on it in the back right there. And there you go. That's how I chose to decorate this settee. And it is a settee, but it's just different. And know that um, when you're looking for a piece of item, take your time, okay? Know your style, know what you like, know what you want. I wanted something different and that's how I've always been on my channel since I started doing this. I'm not a professional. I only do what I like. And this is the type of style that I like. Like I said, I have plenty enough room in my walkway always measure 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 that is very important and when i measured this like i said it i knew that it would absolutely fit in this space right here and let me see i have this right here uh from home goods as you can see and this is by Max Studio Homes, as you can see right there. And I need to get my nails on. And it was it was nineteen ninety nine. And the reason why I wanted to get this right here is because of the gold that is up here, and because the box is black. Because everyone knows I love mixing my metals. Okay, because I have so much silver in the nail heads uh, that is in the satay, in the canvas art that is trimmed in silver, I wanted to go ahead and bring in something else that would 
uh, still go with what I'm doing, but also be a little bit different. And what I'm going to do with this, when you see boxes like this, if you have remotes, and I plan on using it for a remote, for the remote, it's going to go in here like that. This one is going to fit right there. Okay, and I have plenty enough room. Put the top on top of it. And you may not see, but I'm going to sit it right over here. Okay, and you can kind of see it. So what I'll do is I'm going to see if I can take a picture or either uh, show it to you when I finish a video. Okay, again... My name is Diamond76. I hope that you like how I chose to style this. You can do this for a sofa um, or a different type of settee uh, that fits you. You can still do the same thing. And again, my name is Diamond76, home decor on a budget. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. And if you like my content, please uh, thumbs up my vi thumbs up my video, okay? <laughs> and if you want to join me on my Instagram, please join me at Diamond Two Eight Seven Two. And I gotta go see what else I can do, okay? <laughs> and always remember to put that diamond touch on anything that you decide to do, and. I'm finna go see what other trouble I can get into. <laughs> what else I can fix around my house. Again, thank you for watching my video. And I will talk to you guys in another video. Bye.